So Jesus Cuela knocks out Juan Mar Lopez in the second round. Not really surprising. Most people have been saying that Lopez is shot for a while now. This was his fifth KO defeat. Right from the opening bell, Cuela looked stronger, more confident, more aggressive. And he was putting Juan Mar under pressure. Juan Mar was trying to stay cool, trying to stay calm. But the, the power and the intensity of the punches from Cuela, you could just tell that Juan Mar was in trouble. Because the way this guy's been knocked out previously, this was his fifth knockout defeat. So he'd been knocked out four times previous to this fight. And he was knocked out in his last fight. So the way that Quayla was winging shots, the strength that he seemed to have, you knew that it was only a matter of time before one of those shots cracked one more. Unless one more landed his own shot first, because one more can punch himself. But you knew in your head, you just thought in your head, you know what? This guy's going to clock one more before long <laughs> because his shots have a lot of intensity. He's got one more on the back foot. It's, it's inevitable. And that's what happened. In the second round, he clocked him. One more went down face first. The fight was over. So it is what it is. You would hope that one more retires now. I know he was a very proud ex champion, but you would hope that he retires now because we don't want to see no one get hurt in the sport of boxing. So it is what it is. Drop your comments below. How do you feel about Jesus Cuela? How far do you think he can go? And do you agree with me and think that Juan Mar should retire? I thought that Juan Mar should have retired, to be honest, way before now, even after the second uh, Salido loss, because he just didn't look the same to me. He looked shot to me. And now, obviously, I definitely think he should retire. So, yeah. Drop your comments below. Let me know how you feel. This is Hatman. I'm out.